Welcome to the Honeypot's Grave, the internet's premier internet comment commentary podcast. I'm today we have Coyne. with us. <laughs> okay, I guess <laughs> that went well. Uh, today we have with us a very very special guest. Uh, introduce yourself. Good introduction. It's bongo time, uh, lads. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, last episode, we said there were going to be bongos, we and guess lying. what? <laughs> For once in my life, I was not fabricating the truth. There's bongos. Mm-hmm. There certainly is. So, thank you. So I guess. I'll... <laughs> <laughs> this is going very swell. <laughs> this is going to be a very good episode. I guess I'll pick a comment. This is going to be our fucking magnum opus. Tom McDaniel. The tires and cars are like shoes, not feet. And then Greninja replies, Tom McDaniel, I just really hope you pass away. XD. <laughs> <laughs> oh Jesus Christ! Uh, so, uh, hmm. First off, this man is wrong in every mm. way, shape, and form. He uh. Also, there are seven whole replies that we are not seeing here. Yeah, we're missing out. Yeah, obviously, this man has escalated the conversation from car shoes to something worse. Okay. So if the tires are not like feet, then what are they? Or if the tires aren't well, shoes? Well, it right there. <laughs> they are the... Oh god! How does a bongo make that noise? So you, you think he's wrong about the tires yep. being shoes? Explain. Yeah, they're feet. I think he's right. The hubcaps are the shoes. No. Yes. Not all what? cars don't need what? hubcaps. Exactly! That's why they're shoes. Think about it. Think about it! I'm thinking about it. <laughs> and they're sh- the tires are shoes. Put your brain in its place and fucking think about it. I'm thinking, I'm, th- I'm thinking that the tires are like shoes. <laughs> Any so... input, Bongo Man? Thank you so okay, much. Okay, fair. I guess they are kind of like shoes. <laughs> the alternative is that the rims are bones. Oh god. No, cuz yeah. they can come off. No, cuz the rim I can rip up. I you can bones can come off. <laughs> no, they're not just, supposed to. <laughs> they're not supposed to, but they can. Oh god. <laughs> We are getting into some very bad implications about car anatomy. Anyways, which part of the truck is the part they can fuck? Uh, <laughs> there isn't really any part of the truck that can fuck, is there? I mean, you have, like, the muffly bit at the end, where it's the fucking exhaust pipe. <laughs> it's the fucking bit. I, I guess. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, wait, if the tires are like shoes, then what is the feet? The rims! No, because the rims are on top of the shoes! That doesn't make sense, I do not put my shoes inside of my feet. Thank you for agreeing with me, bongos. I, 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 I propose that the uh, rims are like shoelaces for the car. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> what is the part that the tires go on? Because those are the feet. Yeah. Uh, I have no idea. I think they're just called like... I don't know. I don't think they have a name, actually. I they're just called they're like... rims, and the hubcap goes like on top of those. Oh, right. No, yeah, I'm stupid. Yeah. We are not very smart at car terminology. We know nothing of cars. <laughs> when an Uber person says that they're in a Honda Civic that's blue, what I say is, well, I know what blue is. I know. <laughs> yeah. Me, okay. when I know what blue is, I know what blue is. 
I know what Blue is. It's the best character from Blue's Clues. And Foster's home. Lol. Well, well, he's not the best character. He's like second best. Mm. Debatable. I've said this before, but Blue and Mac have the same dynamic as uh, Bender and Fry. I don't know who those two are. From Futurama, you dipshit! Oh, shit! <laughs> oh, I thought you said Ben and, uh, Fry. And I was really confused for a bit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. You should pick a comment now, I guess. Alrighty, I just... Uh, here we are. Ahem. <clears throat> Jody M. Two years ago. I was eating bread while I was watching this, and it turned to toast. Fire, fire, toast, toast. Okay. Those last four words are emojis. This got two and a half thousand likes. That's insane. Okay, I think I might know what this is from. Oh God. I don't what? know. I don't know. What? Wait. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna do some digging. <laughs> it's a shame that some of this bong going is gonna get edited out. Maybe so. <laughs> because we're not talking while you're bong going. Okay, I don't know what this is from. Not to be anticlimactic, but I don't know what it's from. Congratulations, we just wasted all that time. We really fucking did, huh? Nice. Ah, uh, jeez. Okay. So, I know that this was from a song. Definitely, yeah. So uh, I really wish you found the song so we could put this in the playlist. Oh god, oh fuck yeah! <laughs> Peer pressure. Holy that, shit. That would be good. So I'm pretty sure that the song was good. Which oh means, yeah, goddamn it. Which means it can't go in the playlist. It can't it's too go good. in the playlist if it's good. God damn it. Once again, so, I have been bested by my own logic. I wish I knew what the song was. Me too. <laughs> this is just like one of those mysteries that never gets solved. It really is. This, there's nothing to add. Really, <laughs> there's nothing here. Basically, they uh, said the song was really good, and I just enjoyed how they said that a lot. Yeah, true. Okay. Uh... <laughs> Gazoon tight, first off. Uh, second off, we have an underlying problem with this format. Uh, Which is? Because uh, we have a third person here, and also I'm not sure if they're actually gonna, like, speak and, like, read off a comment or two. Like, we did not plan this out very well. We didn't. And we really did just, like, start recording this for no obvious discernible reason. Well, we okay, I can it still had now, but I, I can, let me make a confession here, please. Uh, Go for it. I actually play the bongos, right? I just sort of have a pair with me. Uh, I, yeah. I kind of have been looking forward to saying this for a long time. It's, it's a building sense of shame inside me. Like, I can't play the bongos, I'm really sorry. I've disappointed them. <laughs> You're doing <laughs> fine. I don't. I don't. I don't Honestly, know. I can't play the bongos either. So like, you all fooled your, all me. Your fans are just gonna. I bet you're gonna lose fans, especially because you. No, <laughs> no. <laughs> we're, we're losing fans because someone can't play the bongos. Oh my god, bro! No, no, you posted an way. unskilled bongo playing. You are I mean, going to look. lose subscriber. <laughs> <laughs> all three of our fans are gonna kill us now. Look, this is what happened to my bongo podcast. All right, I came on. And they found out it could play the bongos, and it, it, it didn't go well. Alright. And the same thing will happen to you, I'm sure. Well, that sucks. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Join us next time, where we come live from a ditch in the side of a road. 
<laughs> and we read off scraps of paper that fell out of people's cars. Most of them are Burger King receipts. I don't even live near a Burger King. There used to be a Burger King in my town, but it's a gas station now. <laughs> Number 15, Burger King foot gas. The last thing you'd want in your gasoline is somebody's feet fungus. As it turns out, that might just be what you get. Now, the th now actually, uh, I don't know if you know this, but I'm pretty sure, I think I heard I somewhere don't. that foot fungus is like an effective fuel. <laughs> I am going to remove my spleen. I hate that so much. <laughs> so, uh, Number 15, spleen removal. So, Mr. Bongos, are you going to huh? do it? Are you going to read a comment or? Oh, of course. Are you sure. going to be the nice. third host or are you just going to be background? Uh -huh. I'll be honest, uh, the the plan at first was just to come here and play Bongos, right? Yeah. Uh, but I, I can I can do this, sure. Just pick anything from the pin messages? Yeah. Yeah, just literally anything that is a comment. Sure, sure. Um, is this... I'm not sure this counts as a comment, but it says... Uh, no, right, that doesn't count. Oh, it might count. Uh, if it's literally anything that isn't the Sasuke did nothing wrong post, <laughs> then literally fucking go for it, Chief. Well, it, it was Sasuke did nothing wrong on the side. Well, no, Maybe that's we should... one of our sponsors. Okay, <laughs> that's our question. sponsor message. So who here, who here has, who here knows Sasuke? Like, uh, I know like nothing of him. Sasuke. I know his name, but not his like way of doing things. Um, or any personality like traits. So, so am I the only one here who has seen Naruto? <laughs> yes. Okay, nice. What, what's a Naruto? Okay. It's a, the type of food from Japan, I think. <laughs> it's gonna, it really <laughs> is, <delicious>. actually. <laughs> Naruto is like a thing they put in ramen. So that's what? like... What? Yeah! <laughs> it's like naming your child Crouton. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna name my child Crouton. Just try and fucking stop me. I was gonna say we could perhaps discuss Sasuke, but <laughs> no, <laughs> I'm the only one who knows what he's done. Is Sasuke also a food? No, that's is like that a regular is... name. <laughs> is that what the word sauce is from? No, Sasuke is just like a regular name. It's like a... <laughs> it's like it. A... Hi, this... Hi, this is my son, Gravy Child. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I guess pick a fucking comment. Oh my oh, god. <laughs> did, did that count yeah, as a comment, really? Or... No, it does not, sadly. I think it's we a got a few minutes out of it. <laughs> sure, I can, I can do something better here. Alright, I think this is a picture of a wire tied in a loop, and it's a comment by Sky Underliner one year ago, and says, Best intercourse music if your GF is an insect. And there are four likes. Wow, four likes. Right. That's higher than I can count. Uh, are there any thoughts on that? Uh, um, well, I we really wish we, any thoughts. We, we had you guys need two, little to pick them up. We That's had enough. so far two posts that were from music videos, and the fact that we may never know what those music videos are hurts. It's, it's <laughs> like this shameful. is a genuine pain. It's but shameful. you want to know what the best intercourse music is? Uh, you desperately need to know. It's two uh, trucks. Oh. Uh, I don't know. What's that? Two trucks? Two trucks. Oh, you've never heard? Aren't you so lucky? No, wait, is, is that a Neil thing? Yes. Yes, it is. Neil, as you call him. I've noticed you have a channel in here just called Neil. You're in the first yeah, name basis with Kai. It's crazy. Well, it was I didn't want to call it him. Lemon he Demon it. because he've done, he's done so much more than Lemon Demon. Yeah, he is so many things. He's done mm -hmm. so much for the internet, and I can't thank <laughs> him enough. <laughs> thank you, Neil, for my life. <laughs> Oh Anyways, so. uh, inner chorus music. I've, hmm, I really don't know where to go with this one. Uh, yeah, except, for the, except for the music. Except for the fact that they use the wrong U R. Why? You are the GF. Epic spelling <laughs> mistake, sir. <laughs> Looks in the mirror. Whoa, that's hot. <laughs> Wait, that's just narcissism. God damn it. Once again, my ideas have been taken from me a hundred years in advance. God. Narcissism what do you think slaps. insect music sounds like? 
Oh, I think uh, it sounds pretty bad. I yeah, it would sound pretty bad. It'd probably yeah, be like saxophones or some shit. What's wrong with weird. saxophones? I mean, there's uh, nothing wrong my, with saxophones. Generally. My sister used to play the saxophone, so uh, oh, die. Oh, so you I just, mean, I just think like we'd probably do it. I just hate her so much that I hate every single activity she does. We'd have to. Yeah, like, me too. Is that uh, why no, you I, hate I don't Homestuck so much? <laughs> she read Homestuck. No! No, I just hate Homestuck because it's everywhere and it's unescapable. Like, I if I if I look to my left, that's probably a Homestuck reference. You just gotta embrace it. I love. I will embrace nothing. Except your fate, sir. <laughs> no. Uh, so, anyway, I thought uh, about everybody here would be horribly indoctrinated by the Homestuck stuff. Like, I, I got here through um. Am I allowed to say this? Am I allowed to yes. expose you as the Gamzee, yes. the real person thing? I'm pretty Go open about it. <laughs> pretty open Gamzee about was indeed a real person. You know. <laughs> what? what happened there? I'm going to take the time to ask to do this now. Oh, now that Gamzee was a real person podcast now? <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> it might be oh, interviewed. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Where were you on the night? Okay. <laughs> so, so, the truth 2007. Time. The truth behind Bongo. the Gamzee was a real the truth behind the Gamzee was a real person thing is I saw a post somewhere about, like, something about if Homestuck characters were real, and I was like, man, it'd be fucked up if Gamzee was real, huh? <laughs> and then I just made that blog. The truth cut out. <laughs> That's it. It, does, it does is disappointing. I wish I had more to say, but I just wanted to make a fucked up weird Gamzee blog. But all that stuff about the past tense, that he was a real it's just came from nowhere. <laughs> he, he was, was a real now. <laughs> Where is he now? He's roaming the streets of the afterlife, knocking on people's doors, I it, I sending them pamphlets. I decided on the past tense, because it's like fucked up to think that like, Gamzee has <laughs> been in the world and done things and affected it in ways that you're never going to find out. Because he's not here to tell you what he did anymore. <laughs> He's gone. He was real, but you're not going to ever find out what he did while he was real. Genius was just a stage name. His real name was Gamzee. That's, that's why I said along the past tense. Uh, anyways, uh, and of course music. What else would it have? Uh, what's the opposite of bongos? Because it uh, has bongos. Um, Song God. I uh, <laughs> Song gob sounds more like a genre than it does an instrument. Yeah, what was it that? Was that? <laughs> what was that? That was every incredible. single string instrument at once. <laughs> it's the opposite of bongos. Okay, good. I do. I am getting a phone call. Damn, rest in peace. I guess I'll start. I'm going to have to. No, I'm still going. I'm going to text him. Okay. Uh, right. oh, I was gonna take the call in the air. Oh yeah, I feel like someone should just I don't know get you guys dead to rights or something. Um, what's going on with your f podcast format? Oh, nothing. What are you now? <laughs> uh, we're um, oh. I guess currently. Do you do films still? I guess we might do hmm. movies again. Right. Uh, we could if do we movies get, again. I feel I like what's probably gonna happen is we're gonna get tired of movies and then we're gonna get tired of comments like sequentially back and forth so it'll just be both mm. like back and <laughs> forth forever <laughs> so. yeah i feel like it's gonna go in parts of three so like the first three were comment commentaries the next two three were uh we did two video commentary we, we did three movies no we didn't <laughs> you're right. We did two in like one percent of a movie. G Force was a real movie. You said terrible, terrible things about G Force. I remember that at least. I definitely it, remember the fact that we did as fast as possible. We definitely watched three movies. We may or may not have done three episodes about movies. We did like I don't know, one fifth of a movie episode for G Force. Mm. It G doesn't Force? even deserve it. We gave it too much. Take some back. It doesn't deserve it. There was the Corky one. Well, the Corky so one sadly got an entire episode. The, the Corky was... one got a whole episode. I blame 
the Queen's Corgi episode on the fact that we were both very tired and we didn't have <laughs> access to, like, higher judgment skills or anything. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just always tired when I record these, except so, today. The Queen's Corgi episode was kind of a, a mistake because we Definitely. were so fucking tired. We couldn't have watched a good movie, no. It does feel uh, like but you're not going to watch like, good movies, are you? No, I mean, can't. I feel like not for our next movies, three, we could watch, like, some okay movies. Like, mm-hmm. movies that aren't objectively bad. Like, we could watch, like... Uh, I want to say The Room, but, like, that's too no, good. No, we can't talk about The Room. We can't talk about The Room. It's, <laughs> it's too important. The Room, <laughs> the room is Gamzee's, like, heavenly sacred text. <laughs> I yeah, feel we, like every single time we say something strange on this podcast, we're gonna have to relate it back to fucking Gamzee now. I'm sorry. This is my I guess fault. this is a Gamzee no, podcast this now. Is per- <laughs> this is perfect. Now we have an explanation for all the dumb shit we do. It's because Gamzee. Like, it's because Gamzee. Like, if, <laughs> if I cough in the middle of a podcast really hard and almost kill myself with my like lungs bursting, I can just say, "Oh no worries, Gamzee just possessed me." Uh, so bl- so glad to be a prophet. Wink. Is that what the honks sound like out loud? Just- <laughs> <laughs> Audible he's just wink. Coughing so hard, he's like just <laughs> his lungs up. Okay, I'm back. That's what they sound mm-hmm. like. Yeah. <laughs> Gamzee is a chain smoker. I'm <laughs> <laughs> going to kill you. Now. You haven't even read Homestuck, so like, don't even talk about Gamzee. <laughs> don't even act mad about Homestuck. You haven't read it. Gamzee. <laughs> oh jeez. So remember guess- that one? T- remember that one time that I talked so frivolously about Fallout New Vegas, and you were convinced for a whole fucking month that I actually played and beat the entire game, even though I don't even I've never even looked at a copy of Fallout New Vegas. Listen, every time I bring up Fallout New Vegas, this guy talks about it like he's played it for like hours and hours on end. He talks about what it with say? such fucking confidence. I just like being confident. What's the so bad about, about that? I may or may not fabricate some truths about what I've done, but I am an honest person at heart. I'm absolutely if I had certain heart. you've like lied about doing things in Fallout New Vegas. <laughs> okay, well I may or may not have a heart. Well, uh wig I guess. <laughs> <coughs> <laughs> uh, Anyways, I guess somebody loop. should pick Got a comment at this. this point. Well, oh, if we're going in the way of the loops, then technically it's your turn again. So, really? go for it, yeah. Cool. Technicalities. Okay. Technicalities is a really fun so, word to say. Technicalities. Yeah, yeah, very nice. Everyone at home that's listening to this, say technicalities right now. Technicalities. Technicalities. Me like, too. New person in the background. <laughs> Thanks, Noah, for shouting that Noah. at the top of your fucking lungs in the other room. Thank you so much. <laughs> if you, like Noah, said technicalities at full volume so that we could hear it, then I thank you. Okay. So this is from a Wikia contributor at August 5th, 2012. So this is a comment on a Wiki comment, uh, evidently. <clears throat> mm-hmm. Spongebob yes. was so smart, now he's a stupid dumbass. <laughs> now this comment okay. calls so much bridled emotion, and I can't tell if it's hate or worry. Noah has se- now sent me a message w- with saying, you can edit, and yeah, I can so... edit, but you said it so loud, and we were all talking when you said that. So, <laughs> yeah, I, I can't. Keep it in. Keep it in. Yeah, I can't. Yeah. You will be shamed on the internet <laughs> now, sir. Technicalities. <laughs> so, Spongebob uh, is so smart. Now he's a stupid dumbass. Discuss. This was sent in August 5th, 2012. Uh, I'm guessing we agree that Spongebob is a stupid dumbass, but was he's he a stupid dumbass by this point? Dumbass. He has what always he? been a stupid dumbass, ever since his conception. I'd say that that's smart. like... I'd say 
I mean, he's smarter than Patrick, but like. <laughs> he still did fall for all those hooks. Everyone fell for the hooks. You would have fallen for the hooks. Okay, Mr. Krabs did not fall for the hooks. That is true. He's had experience with them before, though, right? He's yeah, probably true. fallen he's, from at one point. He probably was like, he saw one of his friends get taken. Imagine how fucking terrifying that would be if your friend got fucking abducted by aliens and they're right in front of your eyes. I think it's pretty fucked up. <laughs> well. <laughs> I mean, he knew that they would become tuna, so like, how did he know that? He Game saw. theory, Mr. Wait, Krabs wait, used wait, to wait, be wait, human. Wait, 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 wait. Wait, yeah, wait, no, that makes sense! Because in the Spongebob movie, uh, Neptune accidentally just sets his fucking trident to real boy. Oh, Okay, uh, button real in for real. I'm pretty sure that crabs can walk on land, because, like, you remember that one video of the guy who fucking digs up an entire crab from the fucking ground? He you probably saw them over. get shipped over, and he saw, like, an entire tuna can. Why is your cat screaming so loudly? Because she loves me, lol. Wow. <laughs> Why did you have a freak like that? Wow. She's attacking me. <laughs> Why did you have a freak like that? Wow. Anyways, crabs can walk on land. That's that's the crabs entire plot of the- Crabs can walk on land, so, like... I mean, they can walk on land and Freddy fish, too, so fucking, uh... Cool. Can I get your opinions or something? Sure, go for it. Is is Squidward? Well, okay, is, is SpongeBob smarter than Squidward at least? Because I think so. I, I think that theory has avoided. They both share one brain cell. <laughs> I think. <laughs> okay. Okay, I think they share the one figures. brain cell, but Squidward has it more often than SpongeBob. True. Right. <laughs> Squidward has well, more I mean, time sense. with the brain cell than SpongeBob. True. Like, right. remember that one time that he Besides fucking fight. built an entire tower out of snow and he kept getting <laughs> fucking hit? Yeah, that was his not his brain cell time. Uh -huh. <laughs> Sandy said it's my turn on the brain cell, Squidward. Sandy has the most brain cells out of anyone in Bikini Bottom. What? True. What do you mean? People from Texas are stupid. Wait, that's a sponsor thing. I'm not just being terrible. Wait. Right. <laughs> Our <laughs> singular fan from Texas is gonna kill me. That's a sponsor thing. Our new co host isn't Texas phobic, I, I assure you. <laughs> <laughs> this, this is the new co host that's gonna replace both of us. <laughs> Welcome to the Honeypot Scrape, the internet's premier Texas phobia podcast. <laughs> Hosted <laughs> by me, the person who hasn't been introduced, and my co-host. Yeah, you literally have yes. not introduced yourself. You introduced of yourself as you Bongo got Sounds. <laughs> Bongo uh, boy. Uh, hi, uh, you can call me Apple, I guess. Okay. Right. That's a pretty sick name. Having a name that's just like an object that happens in real <laughs> life is very sick. That's pretty cool. Um, like, my usual name going... here is Apple Zoros, at least. I don't know what that means. Well, cool. That's just okay. doubly sick, because it's a fucking dinosaur. Dinosaurs so. What's are an epic win. What's yeah. a Cap'n Wing thing and an a on? Uh, okay. So my wow. name, have my you name in real have life you... is Aaron, and if you, have, you, has, have either of you seen that fucking Key and Peel sketch? Key and Peel? Okay. <laughs> no way. <laughs> <laughs> no. Oh wait, no, is that the one where it's like A.A. Ron? Yeah, they call a bl they call a, somebody A.A. Ron, and people started calling me A.A. Ron, and I was like, okay, I guess this is my new fucking name, and then I got on the internet, and I was like, hmm, I could mix it with Anonymous, the A.A. Non, so I did. Um, do you have wow. two A's? Cool. Are, are you in the dictionary next to Aardvark? Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Glad. That's a yes for me, Chief. Uh, if you really want to know the uh, reasoning behind my name, press 3 on your cellular device. Alrighty, cool. Uh, back when I was in, like, uh... Can you stop shouting in the other room, please? <laughs> <laughs> he wants to be on the podcast! He's no. going to be your next co-host. <laughs> he's, he's fucking 10. He can't be on podcast. <laughs> He's, he's gonna be the podcast co co host when we fucking watch the Ben 10 movie. <laughs> Anyways, uh, about that backstory. Uh, 
back in like middle school, I think, like late middle school, when you're getting ready to go to high school, mm -hmm. uh, our teacher had this sort of whiteboard where it was just like a word document that they kept up there for like a shit ton of time and they just had like a schedule posted on it for the entire day like what we would do in the classroom like oh english starts at blah 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 mm -hmm. this starts at blah 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 science starts never because fuck you specifically uh what they did though was they put it in comic fucking sans which uh, i don't nice. know if you've heard but do not like the that and uh <laughs> One your, day, for no ex- <laughs> Wait, <laughs> are you implying that my teacher is sans skin tone? Yes. <laughs> Wrong. Okay. Mm. Unless they so went, like, unless they went through HRT and also removed all their skin, I do not think so. <laughs> Captain Wingding's teacher after not surviving. <laughs> God, I wish your name started with an S so I could fucking name drop. God damn. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, anyway, uh, one of the teacher's aides, uh, not the disease, like, aiding, like, helping, uh, <laughs> what the- <laughs> 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 well, Anyway, okay. for literally no explainable reason, for some reason, the entire schedule gets deleted. What the heck? That's not supposed <laughs> to happen. So one of the teacher's aides goes like, "Well, what in the gosh darn tootin' is happening here?" Not, not a, not a direct quote, Carson but you know. Texas. <laughs> oh no! A Texas woman uh, and a Texan on the same podcast. <laughs> uh, no, what I'm not from Texas. Next? I have to. <laughs> Final next time on Dragon Ball Z. Wow. Uh, anyways, they like go to fix it, and I, being the snarky middle school I am, say, "Hey, maybe this time don't make it in Comic Sans." And uh, this is this is a little secret here for you, but uh, Captain Wingding uh, actually has some form of link to my real life name, and so. The teacher goes like, oh yeah, okay, your initials, that's what it stands for, Captain Wingding. <laughs> I don't fucking know why or how they fucking thought of that, but it was the greatest decision that both of us had ever made in our entire lives, nice. and uh, I can never, like, thank them enough for that. Thank you, kind of hurt. thank you. For thank you, you. <laughs> Miss, Do I, I don't know how to pronounce her name. You're wow. just gonna name drop your teacher? I'm not gonna name drop my fucking middle grade teacher. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, I will three. give off the first letter though, because there are many letters in the alphabet, so they There's have to few, overlap. Yeah. Uh, her name started with an R, and I have Ronald no idea McDonald's? how the fuck to pronounce her name. <laughs> 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 my teacher, Ronald McDonald. It's like the fucking one. Uh, Mr. BTS Ronald. fucking fanfic where it's like, damn, my mom sold me to Big Time Rush so the fucking dime is slave to them rip lol. Harry Styles fucking suplexes me into my fucking cage lol. My mom sold me again, lads. See you next week. <laughs> <laughs> Your new owners are here. What? Harry Styles opens the door. I open the door, it's me, Goku, he says. It's me, Goku. <laughs> well, oh, we, uh, well it's right. we didn't talk about Spongebob, did we? No, we didn't! Holy we shit, how could, we, how could we freaking do this to him? We did it, to uh, him. oh god. Sponge I don't think there was a point in Spongebob's entire life where he was smart, except for Absolutely the one not. episode... There was the one episode where they were, like, going to space, and he was like, Patrick, don't touch anything! This is Sandy's rocket, we gotta be nice! That's literally the only smart thing he really does in the smart. episode. That was just, like, Cause, cause the next, that, right. Yeah, that was just being polite. Being polite is smart, okay? Mm -hmm. I mean, okay, would fair. you make enemies with someone that can lasso someone and fucking start an explosion <laughs> somehow? I wouldn't. That's fair. Probably. Can I tell you something about, uh, can, can I tell you something that's been distressing me in private for a long time now? Go it for might it. be the place, but okay, sure. Um, I've been thinking about the SpongeBob, SpongeBob episode where he eats snail food and turns into a snail. Disgusting. It's just really, really horrible. Yeah. How, yeah, how is that a thing? 
Well, like, I forgot uh, that existed until about, about a month ago. Doesn't he, like, well, inject I mean... himself with snail chemicals? Yeah, he does inject Injects himself it. with, like, Sorry. snail <laughs> medicine. Literally every single person I've talked to has thought that it was snail food. But no, it's snail <laughs> medicine. You're right, it is. This is yeah, a fucking mandala effect with snail before, food. And I was like... Wasn't it fucked up how he, like, ate snail food and turned into a snail? But I guess... I guess he injects himself with snail medicine and then eats the snail food. Yeah, he eats the snail food as an effect of the medicine. Because it's like snail hormones. <laughs> snail, snail! Snail to snail! S to S, sponge to snail. <laughs> SpongeBob is ASAP, assigned Sponge at birth. <laughs> kill. Was, wait, didn't like everyone else in, on like his street get turned into a snail as well? Yeah, because like, he like bit squidward them. and patch? Because like he fucking tripped and accidentally yeeted it at them? Or something, mm -hmm. yeah. Because with Squidward, he entered his house and started crawling all over his walls, doing something. Oh, yeah, and then he, he like went into SpongeBob's house, get the medicine, went back to his house and like tried to stab him, and accidentally fucking stabbed himself in the nose. Who was snail HRT? Terrible. <laughs> I guess. That was an episode. Was uh, that a Halloween like... episode, or am I just? Like, I don't think I'm so. I think I think since when has there been a Halloween? No, the Halloween episode for that season, I think, was the one where like Squidward dresses up as like the freaking green guy, Morasmus too. You know him, freaking what's his name? The flying do, you, do you guys just want to be the, the flying Death uh, SpongeBob flying commentary Death podcast? Death. <laughs> we could no. do that. We could watch an episode of Spongebob or two every week. That's our next that. episode when That's we finally regress episode. back to movies. We fucking watch Sponge Out of Water because if we watch <laughs> the original Spongebob movie, not only would it be too good, but also I would cry. What do you mean? Is there another one now? There's yeah, Sponge Sponge Out of Water. There's, there's the Spongebob Squarepants movie and there's Sponge Out of Water. And Whoa. I think I heard somewhere like a while ago that <laughs> there's going to be another Spongebob movie. <laughs> I wow. don't think so. I think that's like a skin like bootleg thing that they're doing now that uh, Steven Hillenberg has died because they disrespect old people and their deaths for money. It's Thank like you. that one episode where Smitty Wurman Jigger Man Jensen's <clears throat> grave gets defiled by Mr. Krabs, and right before Mr. Krabs does it, he says, Am I really gonna defile this grave for money? <laughs> of course I am! <laughs> Mr. Krabs said Gallowistrites. <laughs> yeah, he really did. Okay, well, Anyways, I guess we should pick uh, another comment or end it now, I guess. Alrighty, well, it's my turn, okay. and I guess we can, like, do two more comments, and then, like, the loop will be completed, and, and we can summon Gamzy. And then we can summon Gamzy. I'm not gonna attempt a bongo event. <laughs> you can do your bongo version! Oh yeah, yeah we forgot about okay. the bongo event. The event. <laughs> oh right, bongos are real, wow. That's gonna be our... Our finisher is the bongo event. I'm excited to find out what the bongo event is. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Alrighty, this one is from the Anomana Gucci remix of Porter Robinson's Sad Machine. Uh, it's obviously SoundCloud comments, because I don't know if it's on YouTube, but we're counting it anyways. <clears throat> Try and stop us. Uh, <clears throat> well, it's the internet comment commentary podcast not the youtube youtube comment commentary podcast so like okay so first comment male artist dang this song makes me want to dance until i die and then uh like 10 ish like 20 ish seconds later he says i have no depression anymore which okay. honestly is a mood when i listen so, to music unfortunately we have to add this to the playlist Oh god damn it! No. Yeah, oh, the no. remix of Port of Rums and Sad Machine. Yes. Which <laughs> is sad because machine. I like Anamanaguchi. They're a god good damn it. band. Why must we be cursed to, to talk about songs on the podcast? But I got <laughs> now I can't. I can't do my one to one recreation of that one song. God damn, this is terrifying. I'd love to take a break to listen to this song, but. If we can't, we're recording. Oh god, oh we're fuck. Recording, yeah. I could try and do a bongo cover when you can, sounded like. We can just, okay, like, please. pause. <laughs> we can pause oh, the recording, god. listen to it, and come back. No. Okay, wig. Do your bongo oh, cover. Oh, there's a cat in my door. Meow. Meow. 
That was me, not the cat. That was kind of weird. I won't do that again. <laughs> cat was Sorry. wild. Cat bongo version. <laughs> she just hit a bongo to makes a cat noise. Yeah. Okay. That was very nice. So I have no depression anymore either. Yep, this removed my depression. Wow. <laughs> Listen it's to this simple. episode to cure your depression. Uh, <laughs> That's the subtitle. Oh, hey, speaking of subtitles, you know how we literally never put any subtitles on the episodes, even though I say every single episode, hey, that should be the subtitle, and then you well, never maybe, do it? Maybe you should, like, tell me what the subtitle should be instead of just saying, hey, we should do a subtitle. No, I, I literally just said, hey, that should be the subtitle. Well, you gave like, me I a say subtitle, that literally every... so I'm gonna... <laughs> <laughs> okay, do you want a real, actual subtitle for this one? You just gave me one. Anymore? Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> episode 8, fuck you. <laughs> no, wait, episode 8 is fuck you, we have bongo. Is it the bongo sode? I thought that was this a great part. That was part of my contract. Okay, yeah, that yeah, was this on the is contract. The bongo sode. <laughs> <The bongo> <laughs> I should fucking redraw the logo, but with bongos. Oh, absolutely. <laughs> Oh, the, God, bongo oh, pot, the bongo pot's grave. <laughs> oh god, oh fuck. <laughs> the bongo pot's bong grave. Bong. Do you have a- Do you have, do you have a theme? <laughs> no, wait, a we bong grave a theme, is my- We unfortunately. We do like not have any theme. This episode. I can record it after. We should have a theme. We mm-hmm. should. Like, if we both had le motifs, we could just fucking combine them into this mm. amazing, like, fucking musical stands of pain. Did you say limo teeth? Yeah, that's not how it's said, sir. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's, it's lame teeth. teeth. <laughs> Shut up, the T is silent. It's just like pterodactyl. Shut up. The T <laughs> isn't silent in pterodactyl. <laughs> Shut the fuck. Limo <laughs> teeth ball. Dude, dude, what if a girl was this? Don't make fun of me. <laughs> pterodactyl has a silent P just like the P in swimming pool. Wow. Swimming wow, you, too, sounds good. <laughs> swimming pool? Swimming pool. No, no. <laughs> swimming pool has a silent P. Yeah. <laughs> fucking... PSA. <laughs> Piss pool. Why did you say I'm that? I'm glad you called that me. Piss pool. <laughs> Why would you say that on our podcast? Wow. I can't believe this. <laughs> Looking for new goals. Well, I mean, well, <laughs> he's on the episode for one. Why are you yelling I'm at him? I'm talking to you. What? You're the one who said piss pool. Why would you say that? <laughs> piss that pool. Lol. Yeah, it was lol. Oh, okay. Not fucking piss pool. Sorry, I'm a moron. <laughs> Don't make me tap the sign. Mm-hmm. Uh, anyways, what was I saying Fine, before the anchor? Yeah, so, <laughs> the anchor I was gonna say something before so piss pool, but now I can't fucking remember what I was gonna say. God damn it! We were talking about on a the word lay motif and part silent T. <laughs> Isn't it light motif? I'm I'm gonna fucking Google this right now because I'm angry. Same. I don't know what you're talking about. What's what's lay motif? It's like a piece of music that happens a lot in like an album, like right. you know, you know Undertale, and how oh, they have that? like. I've never heard of that. Holy shit! Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> well, anyways, in the fucking game, there's a lot of songs Light that have like. Be quiet! I'm, li- I'm trying to listen to the Google man say leitmotif. Leitmotif. I was right. It's leitmotif. The T isn't silent. You f- fucking numbskull. <laughs> <laughs> well, numbskull is just like Sans, Undertale? <laughs> <laughs> just like my teacher after not surviving? Uh, <laughs> well, wait. Can't believe that my teacher is Sans lol. Sorry, but your teacher is Sans lol. <laughs> Diagnosed with Sans. Assigned Sans at birth. <laughs> Sans is fucking. <laughs> Sans is a mother. Oh, I can't say this. Two fucking curse. God damn it. You have to say it now. You have to say it now. <laughs> Sans stands for SpongeBob after not surviving. What <laughs> <laughs> the <a> fuck? <laughs> SpongeBob after new small body. <laughs> oh god, oh fuck. Uh. <laughs> Go crazy. Uh, 
Go stupid. Mm-hmm. Uh, Oh jeez. Anyways, this is the final comment, Apple. Uh, oh, sure. Choose wisely. Okay. Wait, let me um, remove the one that I already did. Oh, it's gone. Uh, I'm just, this one's another SpongeBob code. I think we had enough SpongeBob. Uh, yeah. We don't need two SpongeBob's in one episode. Um. Here, here we are. Uh, this one is by Sharon Hockett. Seven months ago, and it's a picture of I think a young girl, and it says. Cat in the Hat's funny movement makes me have anything. Okay, this is one of my favorite comments of all time, and I'm so glad we're talking about it. Uh, Do you know about this one? I've seen this so many times, and I think about it oh. every day of my fucking life. So <laughs> Every single time you do one of your daily black flips, back flips, you have to say, Cat in the Hat's funny movement makes me have anything. Okay. <laughs> Shinji, the cat the bad funny move and make me have anything. Huta, <laughs> foosh. <laughs> so you have a lot of prior experience with this one. Okay. Mm-hmm. Um, uh, does the cat I... has funny movement make you have anything? Uh, he makes me have tuberculosis. Okay. So I've seen the cat in the hat movie, <laughs> and I will say that it's bad. Yeah, it's oh, one no, of it's, no. it's bad enough that it would be put on the podcast. Honestly, I love the cat in the hat movie. It's even better than G Force. It's definitely better than G-Force, trust me. I mean, it's better. a lot of... A lot of a lot are of better than G-Force. <laughs> this bottle of ketchup that I have on my fucking desk is better than G-Force, and it's been sitting here for, like, three days in this a row now. This podcast is better than G-Force. <laughs> okay, that's pushing it. <laughs> <laughs> my fucking fingernail is better than G-Force, I can tell you that much. Mostly because it's like ten times as long as any of my other fingernails. I'm gonna take a picture of it right now. People reading this, uh, pay us, pay us money so you can fucking get into our Discord server and see my shitty fucking fingernails. You don't have to pay money to get into the Discord server. It's free. That's what I ever charge. You do now. You charge me like ten, um, whatever your currency is, I guess. (laughs) Ten bungus boins. I guess it's always gonna be dollars, probably. It's, Me too. it's always a dollar. America is the only country in the world, okay? Like, Trust I was me. going on the off chance like you're Canadian or something, who knows? But they have dollars. <laughs> there are no. Canadians in the server. Exactly. There is exactly one Whoa. that I know of, and they're inactive right now. Have they been deactivated as a Canadian? <laughs> if you're a Canadian, like... you have been deactivated. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking rip wall. Rest and die. Bro, you are in Canada. You are going to be deactivated. <laughs> Anyways, oh shit, I fucking put it in the wrong place. I'm stupid. Epic fail. Uh, me when I'm stupid? Wow, I'm stupid. You can include the fingernail on the show. Do you have show notes? Is that a thing? Show notes? I think we like, did, yeah. like, once. Oh. What the fuck is show notes? <laughs> that so. is, that, is that a fucking Tumblr plugin? No, what? <laughs> show I'm confused. notes, lol. <laughs> Show bones. <laughs> Anyways, uh, here it is, gamers. My shitty long fingernail. Take a look. Uh, it's in a book. It's not fucking posting. Hey, there we are. It's disgusting. Oh, it's like he- huge. Humongous. <laughs> Why Sorry, did you not check. cut <laughs> this fingernail? Because <laughs> I regret. Have you I just mean, like not like that one purpose. <laughs> yeah, I did a New Year's resolution to not bite my fingernails, but now I uh, am not biting them, so they're just fucking growing out, and I have not cut them. Uh, okay. <laughs> the the other three fingers that are very short uh, have been my undoings, my failings, if you will, uh, okay. my mistakes. <laughs> Okay. Those are broken resolutions. Okay, nice. Why don't you, why don't you cut them? Like, why don't you get some fingernail clippers? Fuck you. That's why. Okay. That's what teeth are for. Because I like being the best at something, okay. and uh, having the longest are you fingernail going for the world in my record? fucking class, <laughs> having the longest fingernail in my class, and freaking everybody out whenever they see them is uh, visceral. You could go for the longest all- fingernails, maybe. Maybe don't. Shush. Maybe, maybe, yeah. Uh, whoa! Maybe, maybe I didn't whoa. hear the first part of the word that you said, and, uh... <laughs> maybe I'm I didn't hear out of context. <laughs> Maybe I'm taking this out of context. What do you think I said? <laughs> maybe you should cut your fingernails. 
No, I said maybe just have the shortest fingernails and 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 let's go for the record. Well, that was that was what I did before. The shortest also, I'm pretty sure. Record. The shortest fingernail record. I do not have any. I have removed them surgically. <laughs> That's what I meant. Fucking disgusting. I feel, no. I feel so attacked coming on here like this. Well, <laughs> that's what you get for implying I cut my nails. Oh, jeez, this is 50. We've been recording for 50 minutes. Good! <laughs> Perhaps no, for an hour. Time. We gotta be the best at something. No. No. We will never record an hour long podcast. <laughs> we already have, you fool. No, we haven't. That was yes, pretty we have. Good one too. Episode number six, the special episode. You fool. You. <laughs> you. Is that, one, bunk. is that one really an hour? <laughs> Let me check, I'm not sure, actually. <laughs> Anyways, we're nearing uh, the end of the podcast, I think yeah, that's a good it was time. an hour eight. It I was an it's... hour and eight minutes and 39 seconds. I think now is probably yeah. a good time for the bongo event. Oh, oh bongo. yeah, As good true. a time as any. I mean, Every single best. episode that we've had <laughs> has uh, ended in an odd number. That's foreboding. Hmm. Do you uh, do you remember when I was interviewing to come on here in, in the rigorous process and I sent you the recording of the bong of a single bongo event, right? I yeah. vaguely it's, yes. Yeah, so I was looking for I was trying to make noises with the bongo, and that was the first thing that happened. It was this. I suppose we can't show it in here, but it was this loud. <laughs> it sounded like something in the air was breaking. It was wonderful. And I'll try and make it here. Okay. Well, okay. I guess we're not okay. talking about the funny movement anymore. So can we go on ahead. I'm really sorry. The finale. It's time for the bongo event. No, I can't do that. Never mind. Ruined it for you. I'm so sorry. It's what you get for inviting a person who can't play the bongos onto your bongo podcast. This is not a bongo podcast. <laughs> Where are you getting that idea from? <laughs> Assigned bongo <laughs> podcast. <laughs> you just, that's not bongo so date. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> I can't wait until Bongo says 16. <laughs> Are you only going to come on here every eight episodes? <laughs> wow, well, biscuit you, kid. I mean, do you want me back? <laughs> I mean, do you want to come back? I'd I mean, be happy to have you. We're all four guests. Like, Absolutely. If there's, we can never deny a guest, no matter the shitty request. Maybe, maybe eventually. Just like you should get, Spongebob. um... Well, you, just you like in Spongebob. Get, Mm, I, I don't know. Do, do you get someone else in here to start pinging randomly and invite people on? <laughs> just I, like <laughs> at at everyone. <laughs> Look, come with the podcast. I've done that. No. no, I mean not at everyone. I mean specific people who just maybe no. don't even talk. No, literally everyone. Uh, oh, okay. No, we are getting literally everyone for like episode a hundred or something. Oh, if we even last that long. Actually, no, a hundred is too far away. What's a episode good like 69. rounded number? No, still too far away. Like, f less than 50, probably. Do you think you'll make it to episode 25? 10? Oh, yeah, 25 is a good number. I don't even know if we're gonna make it to episode 9, honestly. <laughs> <It's> fucking... <laughs> don't, don't test me. Look, I don't want to be the nail in the coffin of the Honeypot's grave. Really <laughs> <laughs> Our new co-co-host was so bad, I died! <laughs> <laughs> there was once a Coco host that was so bad that everyone died. The yeah, only okay. the uh, <laughs> Aaron little brother, no Mac, just like, <laughs> direct messaged me and said episode 420. Oh god. <laughs> not even not even a Bim Bam can make a 420 episode. You think we can make a 420 episode? They well, skip we episode can... 420. <laughs> So they can well, think they of can something skip good. Episode four well, if we can skip episode 420, <clears throat> then we can, like, skip two episode 420. <laughs> he just said to me again, you have the power. Uh, okay. Well, I mean, episode 20, comma, 4. <laughs> episode 24. Episode 24! Yeah, that could work. That's For episode 24, better. I declare that we have literally every single person in this server. At least, like, for a second. Maybe not At for the whole episode. Guess, Maybe, I don't know. Not for a whole episode, definitely no. That People will quit. 
People have will have to guess. stop eventually because of the fucking headache. You just have, but like, <laughs> it'll, it'll be a battle royale. Whoever's <laughs> thinking so bad. Honey Butt's great! <laughs> battle royale! <laughs> <laughs> Whoever survives the longest in the shitty podcast before we end it gets to be on the next episode. There can nice be multiple grace. winners. There will be multiple winners. <laughs> for, for episode 25, we just talk about a really, really, really shitty movie and go like, This is what you wanted! It'll be fucking terrible, trust me. Well, I feel like... Write that in your notebook. I feel like write that in your future notebook. A good time to end the podcast, I suppose. Anyways, uh, <laughs> see us next time when we probably go back to watching movies. See you then. Absolutely. Outro. Play Epic Win Time. <laughs> Why the fuck are you like this? Wait, Epic Win Time has to go in the fucking playlist. Oh, yeah, it does. I forgot. They can't hear us. They can't hear us. You played yourself. Cool. Thank you for listening to the podcast. Put epic wind time in the fucking...